Hi boys and girls, it's Mr. Kaser. Today I thought we would draw a stethoscope around a heart because a stethoscope is what doctors and nurses use to check our heart rate and when we go in and we see them. And and I just thought it would be nice since uh, it's a nice picture with with everything going on and it would it shows that we, we care about our medical people that take care of us. So the first thing we're gonna do today is and if you don't know how to draw a heart don't worry because i'm going to show you so again i'm just using scrap paper and a pencil and i'm working vertically vertical is up and down horizontal is sideways so we're working vertically and the first thing we do that we always do we always put our name right in the corner okay so there's my name down in my corner right and the next thing i'm going to do is put a little dot kind of in the middle of the paper so when you're working, you can see my dot, and you put your put a dot on your paper so that you know where to uh, make your your lines. All right, you can kind of compare it to where I make mine. So up above my dot a little bit, I'm going to make my heart. To make my heart, I'm going to start off by making this round part and this round upper part. Okay because we're going to make the heart first and then we're going to make the stethoscope around it. So first thing I'm going to do right up here, I'm just going to make a bump like this. Okay. And then I'm going to make a bump like this up and I'm going to fix mine up. I'm made it a little flat and I could have left it if I wanted to. I want to make it a little bit more heart like okay so there are my two bumps and then they're gonna come down below my dot like maybe right about here and they're gonna meet right there okay and there's my heart all right now we are gonna make the ear pieces that go in the doctor's ears right here and to make those, you make a line right here and the line right here. And then going in towards the middle on this side and in towards the middle on this side, I'm gonna make a U shape. One over here and one over here, okay? And we're using this line as the bottom part of the stethoscope so we don't have to redraw this. We're just going to redraw these top lines. Here's what I mean. I'm going to curve around. And I'm going to stop right here. And then I'm going to do the same thing over here. I'm going to curve around. And I'm going to stop right there. So there's a space in between them at the bottom. Okay. So now we're going to make the actual cord or tube part of the stethoscope, all right? Now, I'm not gonna put the circle in yet where the metal piece is that they put on your chest because wherever we end up, that's where, we'll, that's where we will make the metal part, okay? So I come down and I'm gonna loop around and there it is, okay? So now, that's the bottom, going to be the bottom of the other one. This one is going to be the top, so watch. I come down over here, oops, come down over here. I follow it around. I go over and I stop right there. You know what, mine is higher than this one in the picture. That's okay. We're just having fun. And the next thing I'm going to do is make the circle part. All right. So I make my circle. It's just a little, it's bigger than the, the tube. And then inside I make a circle on that. And inside I make a circle in there. All right. Now, I'm going to erase that little dot in the middle. 
And now I'm going to add some details. And the details I'm going to add are this line, this line, this part, okay? Because this is black. So right here, I'm going to make... But you don't have to color it in black. Matter of fact, if you don't have any crayons and you just want to draw it like this, that's fine, okay? I'm just going to show you a couple tricks because I happen to have markers, all right? And when I color mine in, I am not going to color it in the whole way because it's going to make it look like, see how it looks like it's the light is shining on the heart up here, okay? And all you do to do that, to make it look like that, you should put a line up here like this, and then underneath it, I'm going to do it over here too, okay? And then you make another arch, but you don't go all the way up. You don't touch it. And then do the same thing over here. All right? And this is a this is a cool trick to make it look like it gets darker as it gets lower. I'm just going to make lines that are spaced apart. That get kind of closer and closer. Put one in between there. And you know what? If it's not perfect, that's fine. We're just having fun. Okay. And maybe at the very bottom, you're just going to color it in more. Like I said, it doesn't have to be perfect. Okay. So it's kind of the same thing. Then for the, um, the cord, I'm just going to use another color. I'm just going to use purple because that's what I have. Okay. And again, I'm going to make a little oval here and a little oval here because you can see there's a little bright spot on here. All right. And I'm just going to kind of color in around it. And then I'm just going to color in my cord. And you know what? It doesn't have to be perfect. I'm just trying to stay inside those lines as best I can. And I'm following, I'm just following the cord or the tube. I don't know to call, if I should call it a tube. I think it's a tube because, um, and it's a little bigger right here where it goes into the, the circle part. And you know what? I'm not even going to color that part in, Ooh, but I am going to put, I am going to color these ear pieces in. And if you want to, to make it look more snazzy, Okay, I'm gonna make some more hearts, just little hearts, where I make a curve up, curve up next to each other, and then they touch. Maybe, maybe I'll make a little one here. And maybe I'll make another one here. And see how I have tilted different directions? Okay. And you can go back and color these in if you want to. Some are big, some are small. Curve, curve, touch, touch. Okay. And there it is. So that's our stethoscope today to thank our medical people that take care of us. And I hope you're having a good day, and I hope to see everybody really soon, and take care and take help out, you know, your mom or dad or guardian with things around the house, and read a book. All right. Bye, guys. Take care. I'll see you soon.